Good morning, Cougars. I'm Callie. And I'm Mallory with your Thursday morning news. Mr. Quinn has a quick message for all students. Hey, good morning, Tumble High School. Just wanted to come with you this morning and talk uh, for a few minutes about some great things that are going on. I want to commend uh, Red Nation student section for an unbelievable game last Friday night at the Patriotic Show. Appreciate your support uh, and sticking it out until the very end. Super proud of the football guys and fighting until the very last minute, getting us into overtime. Proud, 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 proud of our volleyball team. They had a, a great run, made it to the third round of the playoffs. Uh, and just two nights ago uh, in Giddings against a very talented Leander Rouse team, took them all the way to five games and fought until the very, very last minute. Super proud of their effort and, and uh, for the entire year and, and the way that they approached what went on and, and all that, they're, uh, that they were able to get accomplished this year. And also, along with all the student support for them uh, all the way through the season. Excited about some things that are coming on uh, this week. Starting tonight, we've got the musical. You can go see The Little Mermaid with all of our kiddos from the Fine Arts Department participating in many different ways. Choir, uh, uh, band, orchestra, theater kids, dance, all kinds of great stuff going on. Make sure you get your tickets for either tonight, tomorrow night. Uh, they'll perform twice on Saturday and then again on Monday. So don't miss out on the opportunity to go see The Little Mermaid. Guys, we're just essentially a week away from Thanksgiving break. So hang in there and let's finish out next week strong. Let's make sure you put forth great effort between now and next Friday. Then we get a week off to kind of regather and, and uh, get ready for the stretch run to finals and finishing up in December. So proud of you guys. Remember, you guys are the pride of Texas and we appreciate all that you guys do. Have a great day. A big shout out to Mr. Livingston's architecture students who volunteered recently with a Habitat for Humanity to help build a home for a needy family. Lucas Sefcik, Akash Patel, Darvin St. John, Noah Meyer, Jeremiah Meyer, Leonardo Ortiz, and Cesar Ortiz all pitched in last Saturday. A great example of Cougar pride. The football season came to an end last weekend while volleyball faced a stiff challenge this week. Let's check in with sports for all the latest news. Tomball volleyballer McKenna Law. What's up? So we finished out the season 20, 12 and 2, and that's a really good uh, record for us. So we were proud of the team, and we just, you know, are excited for next year. Go Cougs. Hey, Coach. So uh, what are we looking forward to this season uh, for basketball? Well, you know, you guys have been working really hard so far in practice. We've put in a lot of hours. 
Uh, we've got a lot of guys on the varsity that are all competing for spots and playing time, but they're getting along great. The attitude and effort's been excellent, and that's really all we can ask for. When does the regular season start? We start Tuesday the 15th at uh, Caney Creek, and we play the next week, which is next week's break week. We're at Austin. Uh, we're at Austin, and then uh, Tuesday we're home versus King of Park. All right, thanks, Coach. Tonight is opening night for the newest theater production, The Little Mermaid, and it's an amazing show with much more work going in behind the scenes than people realize. Let's take a sneak peek. And then Down we'll go. here is your home. Ariel, listen to me. The human world, it's a mess. Life under the sea is better than anything they got up there. The seaweed is always greener in somebody else's lake. You dream about going up there, but that is a big mistake. Just look at the world around you, right here on the ocean floor. Such wonderful things around you. What more is you looking for? Under the sea. Under the sea. So be sure to catch this amazing production. Shows are tonight, Friday, two shows on Saturday, and the final show on Monday. Let's check in with ROTC and see how their competition season is going. I have eight bank out. Happy Santiago, I am the company executive officer at Tomba High School. Hi, I'm Ariel Rodriguez. I am the operations officer at Tomba High School. I am Francis Ramos, and I'm the supply officer at Tomba High School. This week, we, this weekend, and the rest of the year, we have various events for that RT does involving the Veterans Parade, the Tomba Parade, everything. This Saturday, we have our Nimitz Drone. It's a state qualifier. Come out and support Tomba High School ROTC. <laughs> Hey y'all, Tomball FFA has a meeting next Monday in the LGI at 6 p.m. There's a lamb and goat check Monday the 14th from 2.35 to 5.30 p.m. before the meeting. We have a progress show at the THS Show Barn on December 3rd for all your TISD large animals. Pick check is right after the progress show and it's not mandatory. Our Christmas dinner is in a mandatory event that's December 5th. Show up in official dress. <laughs> Thank you. That's all for today, Cougars. See you next week. Have a great weekend.